Hello, in this video I am going to show you how to remove the memory from the desktop computer and how to plug it. So I just uh, got the standard desktop computer uh, here to show you uh, the process. So you can open the computer from the hinge and so after open the computer you can see the all the computer items are there so it will come like this. So now can you see the uh, memory is uh, located over here so these are the very uh, very plug and play computers so you can uh, you can remove the uh, components very easily so to make to get the clear access uh, so I will put it this is a power supply I will pull this one up and this is a CD ROM over here so what I will do is I will pull this one up you have this uh, all the marks over here where to pull the uh, items and pull and plug the items so it will so it's very easy you can identify very easily so i will just pull this one up like this yeah now you have the uh, clear access to the uh, memories so here can you see there are uh, two memories so this is a this is a place the memory the lock of the memory so now since this memory is already plugged so if you want to remove it how it's removed securely uh, so you just remove the this hinge pull it outwards and do the same thing for this side as well then after that one you can just slowly pull the memory up so this is the way you can pull the memory up uh, memory outside so don't always not to be sure not to touch the memory pins so it will there's a reaction so uh, it will be static then uh, sometimes your memory will not work so I will show you how I am going to plug the memory again now now can you see in this memory I wish I will keep it here there, there, there's a there's a lock there's a uh, there's a cut over here so this is the memory, so it depends on the memory, like DDR or SDR or something like that. Depends on the memory. This lock, uh, this cut is in the different positions. So you have to be very careful when you are selecting the memory and when you are plugging the memory. So here, in this slot also, you have the same kind of the lock. You can see here there is a same kind of uh, separator. So. If you have the different kind of memory, it will no, it will not go inside properly. So make sure you select the correct memory before you plug it. And when you plug the memory, so first see how it will go inside. So normally, when you see the memory like this, so you can see this cut is going to place in the correct location. If you if you turn the memory other way around you can see this cut is not placed in the correct location so that the memory will not plug it correctly okay so you have to make sure before you insert the memory you is it in the correct in the did you hold the memory in the correct way so the best way to see this cut in the memory and over here in the slot is come into the correct position if that's so so you have to just pull this lock outside and you just keep the memory to the slot and just press it slowly so when you press slowly this lock automatically will be locked so you no need to lock again by hand so this side also just plug it just push the memory down slowly so soon after push it this you can see the lock is automatically getting blocked so this is the way you plug the memory and make sure you can see in the memory slot there are black and white slots is marked this slot is white this slot is black so if you had two memories the if you plug it in the black slot other memory also going to be plugged in the black slot if you put it in a black and white so it will it will not take the memory correctly
so you put this one in the black this one so if you plug this memory in the white slot this memory also you put it in the white slot if you have the four memory cards doesn't matter if you have the one memory card also doesn't matter so you can plug it in the white whatever either way so i hope you got the correct concept how to remove and plug the memory i will show you again one more time so we see in this memory so it's plug it like this so i'm going to just pull this lock outside and this side also i'm going to pull the lock outside and just slowly pull out the memory so it will come like this so when you go on to plug it again so just make sure the memory slots are is in the correct position and you keep the memory gradually into the slot the pull the lock outside and the keep the memory gradually into the slot and push it slowly until it's getting locked this side also push it slowly until it's getting locked so you can see it's a tuck sound is coming is that means it's memory is plugged correctly after that you cannot pull out the memory so make sure it's very sensitive so don't touch the pins of the memory uh, and before you insert just keep it locate the correct position and do it very slowly don't do it in the rush you may make the mistakes be relaxed and do it nicely thank you very much